Hi dear Aries, a very very good morning to you guys. This is Anjali Tarot and this is a general love reading for all the Aries, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the roles can be reversed anytime. Third thing, this is a reading from today till the end of March. So let's start. Your partner's current feelings for you right now are Aries. Let's see. Your partner's current feelings for you right now are... Aries, the emperor, this is your card only, this person is might be not talking to you or this person is acting a little off, detached, cold and I have I have this gut feeling that this person have taken certain kind of decision and they are just, they're just sticking to that, okay, on the other hand it could be vice versa as well that this person is feeling like uh, uh, you are the one who is acting weird and cold and off and giving them cold vibes, okay? And not giving them what they want, actually. You are not showing the emotions, you are not showing the love to them. This is making them a little uncomfortable. Let me clarify the Emperor card. As their feelings for you. Okay, I got the Sun. The six of cups and three of swords. So, oh, this person is deeply heartbroken. Mm -hmm. This person is missing you very much. Missing the happiness that you guys had together in the past or might be when you guys started this connection. Okay. Now, I do see that this person is missing you very, very much and this person is kind of hurt. Deeply hurt. This is like they are in distress. They are in sadness. They are like... They are missing the old good times with you. For some of you, this is a past life connection as well. For some of you, this is somebody who you know from a very long time. You guys had a history together. This is not somebody new. You guys had a history together. And this person basically felt a lot of expansion, a lot of growth, a lot of happiness in this connection whenever they, with, they were with you. Now they are getting this cold and off and detached energy from you. Cold vibes from you. Might be you're not talking to them deliberately. Might be something is making you... Take a bold step of breaking their heart or breaking this relationship altogether. Whatever it is, this person is from your past, and this past person is a past person is completely heartbroken, and uh, they are missing you like hell. They're not liking the energy of you know uh, separation or breakup or not talking to each other and this casual energy. They don't like it. So Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, and Aries. Okay. Leo energy as well. Let me see what you feel for this person. Aries, your feelings for this person right now are... Let's see, Aries. Nine of Cups. This is something... This is somebody who is a wish fulfillment for you. Then why, why the hell are you doing like this? I don't know. Okay, I do feel like this is someone who is kind of wish fulfillment for you. This this person really makes you happy from the core of your heart. Okay, it could also be possible that because you are like right now, uh, because the connection is going through a rough rough patch right now, so you are overindulging yourself in some kind of alcohol or trying to, uh, trying to keep yourself busy, trying to keep yourself happy. Okay, and showing the world that you are fucking happy but you are not might be this is the possibility let me clarify the nine of cups honey king of wands or ace of swords and the eight of wands yeah you are attracted to somebody it could be somebody new it could be someone like who you are might be manifesting from a very long, long time you are definitely attracted to somebody Aries and you are very truthful and honest to this person, you know. You are very truthful and honest to this person and uh, you are ready to have a brand new chapter, you know, start a brand new chapter of your life. I can see that. And you are in constant communication with this particular person. Whomsoever you are connected with right now, you and this, con this person is having a very, very uh, uh, honest and truthful conversation. You guys have a constant flow of communication going on between you and them and this person is might be fairly new to you this is somebody who is quite attractive and irresistible and you you find them quite good for you so this 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 particular person whomsoever you are talking to right now is your heart's desire you know this could be somebody new 
and that's why I might be the past person is sulking because you are moving on to somebody new something fresh so yes i can see that this is somebody you are having a conversation with and there is a back and forth communication there is lots of communication and there is a certain flow in this connection and you are certainly very very attracted to this person i can see that okay this person is your heart's desire now it could be the past person with with new energy but for most of you i do see you are connected with somebody new this is good aries dev sagittarius energy gemini libra aquarius let's see what this person wants from you aries let's see what this person wants from you temperance okay this person wants to bring balance to the situation this person wants you to control your anger control your temper control the emotions bringing balance in the situation <clears throat> could be dealing with a sagittarius here so this person wants you to wait and uh, just wait just lower down your temper lower down your anger and try to you know trying to see things from a different perspective this person and you are not on the same page at all right now okay i do see you i do see you you know uh, with two different energies here the past person is still clinging on to you okay and the past person whom so ever is clinging on to you they per this person wants you to try to calm down try to relax try to understand that things happen and they want to clean the shit with you you know they want to clean the relationship with you and start the flow of connection again let me clarify the temperance card okay just give me a second yes let me clarify the temperance card oh god what's happening it's scattered like your energy right now hari somebody is making you very happy but somebody is crying for you as well this is this is contradictory this is two energies talking to me at the same time temperance is clarified by the three of pentacles the hermit and the ace of cups yes this person wants to have a chance with you a second chance with you okay and this person wants you to work on this connection with them work, want uh, wants you to work on uh, uh, this connection future you know they want you to think from the heart from the heart and soul rather than taking a rash decision so this person definitely wants to work on this connection with you this, this three of pentacles energy is telling me they want to put in the effort and put in the team work they want you to understand that this 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 is a soul connection according to them this is a soul connection this is a past life connection and you should not let him go or let them go just like that okay and this is uh, the ace of cups this is the brand new beginning that they are hoping for with you okay so this person wants you to bring balance on in the situation bring balance in the connection and start talking from your heart start talking from your heart okay start listening to your heart rather than making uh, <clears throat> reckless decisions this is what i'm getting here let's see what you want from this connection or from this person aries magician you are manifesting you are manifesting something it could be a new person it could be a new love that you are manifesting in your life you are kind of manifesting this person or you are manifesting the miseries that this person is going through right now okay so what i'm getting here aries is that uh, uh this person did something wrong with you in the past now you are manifesting that this person uh, should go through the same shit that they put you through in the past so this is what i'm getting here let me clarify the magician as what you want from them this person is you are trying to manifest something from this connection out of this connection might be or something new let me clarify but your manifestation power is kind of enhanced right now the king of pentacles in reverse the eight of swords and nine of swords oh Aries uh, let me be very very honest with you you are manifesting you are manifesting that this person should go through a hell lot of shit they should understand what you what what they put you through okay you are manifesting instability for them you are manifesting that this person should not be at peace at all it could be also possible that you are using some kind of spell work or something negative against them or some kind of you know uh 
black magic around them to make them suffer this is bullshit this is uh, okay Aries if you are doing this by any chance this is not everybody's story please guys this is not everybody's story but if you are doing it by any chance please don't start stop doing that please stop doing that please stop doing that this is not going to work out honey yes I do see you manifesting some kind of negativity around this person you might be manifesting that this person should not able should not be able to sleep without me they should be obsessed with me they should be like uh, uh, in a mental jail and they should not come out of my thoughts come out of the pain that they put me through don't do that honey this is not going to work out this is going to backfire and I am getting heavy Gemini Libra Aquarius energy here Taurus Virgo Capricorn as well let's see yeah let's see what to expect from this person till the end of March Aries let's see page of cups okay I do see an apology coming I do see a message coming I do see an apology coming I do see a manifestation working finally because this person is going through a lot of shit right now they are completely heartbroken they are completely in distress right now and I do see this person you know trying to apologize for something trying to open up emotionally let me clarify the page of cups it's something weird that I'm getting here knight of pentacles the moon and the seven of pentacles okay I do see this person opening up this will this person will start opening up to you but this is going to be a very slow process that you will be like quite frustrated that uh, this is not going anywhere the manifestation is not working the black magic or the, the, the spell or whatever you did to make this person come to you like this is not working so it might frustrate you a little bit okay this is working the manifestation is working but this is going to be a slow process it's, it's going to be quite a slow process so you have to be patient again if you are doing something wrong like some kind of black magic or spell work don't do that if you have already done that please stop that please stop doing that but if you are using some kind of law of attraction techniques or something that is positive don't don't exp don't manifest suffering from anybody for anybody it's like uh, because if you are su if you are like manifesting suffering for other person this is going to backfire you in the like in the near future or in the future so it's kind of not recommended at all you know trust yourself manifest your happiness your abundance not anybody else's uh, uh, I'm not getting the exact word not and uh, not anybody else's negative things you know you just want to put them put them through some kind of shit so that they can understand what he, what they did with you oh my god this is it's kind of yeah so but I do see this this person's apology coming in this person's messages coming in but I don't see a growth or expansion with this particular person because I do see although they are coming this person is kind of slow very slow but this is something stable and solid but they are going through some kind of you know uh, trauma some kind of anxiety some kind of pressure thing and I don't see this person doing much about this connection right now they're just waiting for the right time might be just waiting for the right time to act upon the situation okay this is what I'm getting here so yeah three messages for you Aries messages for you till the end of March the X breakup or separation the mirror and the heartbroken oops there's a separation or there's a breakup there's a pattern going on in your life there's silent treatment and abandonment going on in your life right now I told you this is the three of swords this is uh, some kind of breakup or separation happening three of swords and this is a breakup or separation thing mirror mirroring each other self image relationship reflect our wounds introspection so you have to introspect it is you have to understand the pattern in your life and you have to come out of this cycle yourself you have to break the chain okay so whatever you're feeling, whatever you're going through right now, this person is also feeling the same. Heartbroken. Somebody is deeply heartbroken. I tell, I told you, somebody is deeply heartbroken. Somebody is uh, going through some kind of separation, breakup, feeling lost, grieving, mourning. 
again the three of swords this is making sense to me so thank you so much aries for tuning in i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste